We're with Mim Strom after our pre-season hit out against West Coast. How are you feeling after that one? Yeah, good. It's really fun to play someone that wasn't um, ourselves um, and, you know, see how some of the teams might play. Um, so, yeah, it was really fun. Credit to West Coast. It was a um, really good hit out. Three weeks to the season proper, so great to get that hit out in. How's the body feel pulling up after that one? Yeah, good. Obviously, we have to, we've got some big tacklers in our team, so we're used to getting hit um, pretty hard. Um, so, yeah, we're, um, we're looking fit and feeling well. Um, I think everyone's pulled up pretty well too. Plenty of goals on the board today. Who impressed you off the top of your head? Yeah, everyone, um, I think, was playing their role, but particularly um, on your tie. Um, well, uh, she did get on the board, and um, but she's just the biggest team player. And if, if teams want to, you know, go to her and double team her and whatever, um, that's fine because we've got lots of other forwards that can get on the scoreboard, clearly. She can do it in the air and on the ground as well. She had a couple of one-on-ones that she um, just ha seemed to, to win with ease. Yeah, well, um, she's been playing against our backs, and I know they don't like... Um, <laughs> having to cover her off so anyone that comes against her good luck because um you know she's yeah like you said she's up in the air she's on the ground and she's got that speed Gabby O'Sullivan potentially <laughs> the highlight of the day with a nice big hanging mark I'm sure she won't let you guys forget about that anytime soon no nah, she'll be talking about it all week unfortunately um but it wasn't very very impressive she got pretty high and she'll be um she'll be she'll be um pretending she's going to take my ruck spot soon some of the newbies as well, great, um, another chance to see them. Ariana Hetherington, for one, who's only just joined the list um, in the recent weeks, but she um, was solid down back. Yeah, I thought all the, the new players um, were very, very impressive. Gibbs down back was super solid. Again, Ari's looks like she's been playing uh, forever, slotted in beautifully, and um, TJ in the mid just really getting to work was really good as well. And without um, giving anything away, the, the Lisa Webb game plan, it seems like the girls are really adapting quite well and um, it's, it's coming together quite nicely. Yeah, well, um, we've got a super clear game plan and um, we've all been, uh, you know, studying up and um, it's great that we get to put it into practice um, and hopefully we'll just keep building from there and the main thing is playing all our roles. Hayley Miller and uh, Kara Bowers once again through the middle, um, driving the ball quite well. Um, Hayley Miller copped a, a couple of big knocks as well in the contest, but um, how did you see their game today? You couldn't ask for better midfields um, with all our midfields, but especially, you know, Turbo and Miller leading in there. It's um, you just feel so confident having having them in there to you know tell tell you where where we're going, where we're hitting, and um, yeah, it's just to build that co cohesion. Um, we're starting to build with you know the new players and stuff. Um, I think Eastie's doing really really well. She's um she has to match up on Kiara Bowers every week, so good luck to whoever has to line up on her. Final tune up uh, next weekend against Collingwood. Looking forward to that one, and then obviously the season uh, proper against uh, Eagles again in RSC Derby. Yeah, it's um it's good to you know have these hits out, hit outs against the teams because we don't know how any team's going to shape up against last year. Um, I think we're pretty different from last year, and likewise that some of the other teams might be. So I think we're more focusing on our game and how we can execute, and it'll be a really good hit out against Collingwood. Let get in the rooms. Thank you. Thank you.